What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of our streamers cheaters today We're gonna to be taking a look at a twitch tv streamer This guy goes by the name of cat metal now to me This guy appears to be locking onto every single person who he shoots So what we're gonna to do today We're gonna to analyze some of his gameplay and let you guys decide whether or not you believe the same If you do enjoy the video be sure to hit that thumbs up if you're new subscribe and turn on notifications So you don't miss any future videos and don't forget to follow me on Twitter at BadBoyBeeman. This is the best place for you guys to contact me about any streamers, no matter how big or small, if you believe they are cheating. Right, let's crack home with the video. As always, guys, we come across to the channel to check it out. Cat Metal with a 3 instead of an E. 105 followers. Now, looking at the recent broadcasts, it all seems to be Pokemon Sword. Okay, there's nothing here to do with call of duty warzone that got me thinking of i am i on the right channel is this the wrong person we scroll down a little bit and on cat metals recently streamed categories that are pokemon sword as well as call of duty warzone right next to it so obviously we've got to go and check out the video section now but even on the video section it, there was nothing at the top there recent broadcasts but in the clips there were definitely some but then as we went down a little bit you can see that there are call of duty warzone streams as well as clips 36 minutes 44 minutes 43 minutes these are very short live streams i know a lot of people don't have the time to do it maybe some people just do it for fun the weird thing is there's also a picture of a dog right in place of a webcam okay so this person is trying to pretend to be a dog while the name is cat metal like, i'm confused are you a cat or a dog anyway so what we did we decided to go and take a look at some of the footage from the streams and we've clipped some of it and we're going to show you them right now let's take a look as you can see here it's very laggy he's streaming and he's only getting below 60 fps it's just gone above 60 fps but there again look where his webcam is let's say it's a webcam <laughs> the picture of the dog is covering up the kill feed so you can't tell whether or not he's getting a headshot but based on what i could see on both of them kills they were both aiming directly at the head okay Let's keep watching and see what else we can see. Because those first two kills weren't extremely suspicious, okay? What we've got to take into consideration is the low quality of the stream. So it may appear to jitter at times anyway, due to the low quality. So we'll be keeping an eye out for that and making sure that we don't confuse it with anything that could be a lag from aimbot as you can see the quality here it's really laggy and that's a 60 fps it looks to me like whatever streaming software he's using is dropping frames while he's actually live anyway continue watching and see where he goes from here there was a heartbeat sensor there that you failed to pick up i mean me i'd be i'd be dropping that decoy grenade and picking up that heartbeat sensor wouldn't you that's what i'd do He sees someone. You can see a sort of glitch in there. Headshot. Again, because of how laggy his stream is here, and it's really bad, I'm sorry guys that you happen to witness this, by the way, but because of how laggy it is, you couldn't actually see whether or not the aimbot was jittering around the enemy head. But he did definitely get a headshot. And let me tell you as well, when you are getting lag spikes like this, if the game is jittering for the person using it, even if they have cheats, it can cause the cheats not to work at times as well. He's in the vehicle there. Let's keep an eye out on this rock here. And he can't see anyone. He's not seen anybody up there. Oh, and look at that. A headshot. Another clean shot on a person that he shouldn't have known was coming in that direction. But he jumped out of the vehicle at the perfect time and started lining his shot up through the bus stop. Let's call it a bus stop. I believe that's what it is. And then took the shot and got a headshot. Watch this first shot right now. You see that sort of adjust itself onto the enemy's head. Although the visuals aren't very clear due to the frame rate and things like that on his stream. Come on, shoot someone out the sky. He appears to be being very careful with what he's doing with his aimbot, if he is using aimbot at this point. I'm still unsure. Some of the shots are very clean, although we've seen many headshots. In fact, I don't think we've seen anything other than headshots to this point. Let's continue watching and see whether or not he absolutely lasers anyone, snaps onto anyone, or knows where somebody is without knowing where they are. 
That's what we're keeping an eye out for throughout this. His movement's not that of somebody who's a pro or a very good gamer, at least. Yeah, that, that to me there looked like aim boss as well. Same again with that. You see a very small jitter, although the quality is very poor, you could see the jitter. What do you guys think of this so far? Do you believe that this person is using aimbot or this dog or cat? Do you think they're using aimbot? In my opinion, it looks to me like headshot only aimbot so far. But a very clean snap, okay? So he's got a very small field of view by the looks of it. So it's not absolutely snapping on. He seems to have some sort of smoothness settings in there as well to stop it from snapping too fast even when it's within the small field of view so we'll go and check out a couple more clips now and try and see if there's anything that is blatant because so far all of that is sus but nothing that screams out yes 100% aimbot so we're going to go and check out a couple more clips now at this point he's running towards one of the hangars on airfield starts taking a look over the ice you can't really see anything over there from where he stood but look at this picks out his sniper and then oh Please lock on. Yeah. And then, oh. Please lock on. Yeah. The enemy is running and in cover, and due to the distance, there will be bullet drop. And as we've discussed in previous videos, you do not always hit every single shot. So even though he didn't get the kill over the bunker when he was shooting over the ice, you can see that it locked on to that first one. This is just poor quality, honestly. He's actually getting 70 FPS, 75 FPS there, and it was lagging like shit. Ridiculously bad. Like, even if this guy was, like, the best ever, and his stream quality was like this, it would be really hard to watch. Look at it. Let's see if he can laser this guy out the sky. He's being very careful, okay? He's not taking the long shots, and you can see that. Again then, until that enemy was downed, it was locked onto him. Even when he was downed, locked on. And then the shot after he'd killed the enemy, like, was all over the place. Let's try and get some final circle beef going now. See what he's like in the final circle. Usually at this point, anybody who's trying to be careful with cheats throughout, when it gets to this point, they will literally start taking shots that they shouldn't be able to take just to get that win. They're so close to the win, so they'll go all out, all or nothing. Not all people do it, but a lot of streamers who are cheating, you will see them doing this. Again, locked on. That locked on to the enemy there. Can we go back and watch that again? Watch that shot again. So he's actually already aiming towards there through the building. Through that little hut in front of him, he was aiming towards that location. Very poor quality, honestly. It's really difficult for me to watch this. It makes me a little bit dizzy. Okay, so now where is he aiming? Where is his crosshair placement? He's being very careful, okay, checking all areas, even though he probably knows that the enemy is, like, stood right here. He's being very careful with it. At this point, it's 1v1v1, so there's only three of them left, including him. I say him. It could actually be a hair. I can't hear any voices. Runs out into the open airfield, to whatever position, because obviously he knows where enemies are. Look at this, and... No, nope, I thought the enemy would have peaked there. Oh yeah, okay. Took that shot. This is so hard for me to watch. It's really, really straining my eyes. So it's 1v1 now. Let's see where he is. Just getting perfectly sense of circle now. Without a worry that the person's coming from behind. Oh, 
And there you have it, final kill. So here's the part where I say that due to the absolute awful quality of that stream and how laggy it actually is, it made it a hell of a lot more difficult to notice whether or not this person was using aimbot. But without fail, every single kill that he got that we've seen today on this video was a headshot and it was unnatural. There was absolutely zero recoil patterns on guns and then his sniper shots at distance on enemies he should not have been able to see or to even bother looking in that sort of direction. So to me, it looks like this person, Cat Metal, is using aimbot and wall hacks. What do you guys think? I'll give you my opinion. You let me know yours in the comments below. Well, there we have it, guys. Cat Metal seems to be locking onto people all over the place, in my opinion. What do you guys think of that? Let me know in the comments below. And if you did enjoy the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. If you're new, subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any future videos. We've got some big things coming to the channel very soon and you don't want to miss it if you want to support the channel favor hit that blue join button today and become a member of the triple b fam and don't forget guys we have currently got our hacker hunter merch available now it is only available until april the 30th 2021 it is first edition merch don't miss out and don't forget to follow me on twitter at bad boy beeman it's the best place for you guys to contact me about any streamers no matter how big or small if you believe they are cheating until next time I'll catch you on the flip side. P -p -p Peace!